Hey guys, welcome back to Magic TV. My name's Carl. Will you shut the fuck up? Hey guys, my name's Craig. I'm trying to do the intro and you're being a dick. Hey guys, my name's Craig. Welcome back to Magic TV. It's nine o'clock on a Thursday, which means it's time for the next episode of the Match Entry 2.5, uh, the blockumentary. <coughs> Excuse me. Something went down the wrong way then. <coughs> Can you talk for me for a minute? <coughs> oh, you know when you swallow and it goes down the wrong hole? I just swallowed and it went down the wrong hole. That, that was weird. I've been used to swallowing by now. Oh, it was horrible. <laughs> that was horrible. Anyway, I'm back. Welcome to uh, <laughs> welcome back to Magic TV. This is just a shit show. Isn't it? Just, <laughs> what welcome, a first minute of a video. <laughs> welcome, back to, welcome back to Magic TV. Fucking and uh, <coughs> I'd like to the just say... The least professional thing on the face of the earth. Every not video that you're not involved in... We've got, like, Mr. Eddie over here. I'd just like to point out, Michael, any video that he's not involved in is way more professional, isn't it? Yeah, and it goes really smooth. The second the matter arrives... I'm not I'm literally just, just sitting here doing nothing. Can you pass me my coffee? Sitting here... As it's a shit show, I may as well have a drink at the same time. Fuck I'm it. I'm sitting here minding my own business. Right, OK. So, here's the thing. <laughs> uh, before we start... <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Before we start, I would just like to point out... Official statement from Magic TV. Oh, What's this? I'd just like to point out that last week I was not getting my ass shaved. <laughs> <laughs> so it's still knotted? That's a tea. I think that's yours. Oh. It's all right. I don't drink tea. <laughs> Pass the wrong one over. It's all right. Don't worry about it. Fuck's sake. We're, 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 the we had to go extra professional. <laughs> yeah. So the. Um, so you're still all knotted up? There's no fucking. <laughs> Ass shaving. My ass is fine and does not need shaving. For the multiple people that messaged me, so you mentioned asking how my video. ass shaving um, went, it didn't fucking happen. Well, you was, need to get it sorted. I don't know. How many times have you seen my ass? I'll have you know, the one person who's seen it quite regularly, which is Sarah, seems to find me fine with the hair ratio that's around that area. <laughs> You can tell this has been bad on the comments and messages and stuff, because <laughs> this is the second video in a row that he's mentioned it on, so it must be really bad. Yep. Which means success. <laughs> and I would like to point out that I was very impressed. I wasn't here last week, because I was in Blackpool. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, not getting my ass shaved in Blackpool, I was there looking after my son. He was, uh, he was performing. Uh... But I just want to say, I watched the video, direct from your bathroom, yep. and then sat down with, with Jack, super impressed. Like, seriously, joking aside, you got that right up there. It's, it was right up there. I mean, it's four inches. It's yeah. slightly smaller than uh, Mark Spellman. He goes yeah, four and a half. Yeah, but we can't all be as big as Mark Spellman. Well, oh, that's true. You know, you know it's, it's not the size of the nasal cavity. It's how you use it, right? Yes, so. Yeah. So, uh, impressed. Four and a half, it would literally hit the back of my head. Four and a half. And the four inch nails were the biggest ones they had in Wix. Okay, no, 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 it's fine. It, it, I don't think anybody would be sitting there in the audience going, that's not bad, is it, darling? Yes, that's, 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 that's really good. You know what would make it better? If you had a bit of a, an extra half an inch on that nail, that would make all the difference. No, they're sitting there puking, going, what the fuck is that? absolute dickhead doing to himself yeah. is what they're thinking um don't, drink on no, don't drink on camera it's, it's unprofessional what are you doing disgusting <laughs> no drinking drinking the camera while I'm filming. Brilliant. <laughs> so um yes very very impressed very very good thanks like it, it, how like i've had people just go oh my god matt's so inspirational he actually did it. We thought it was all bullshit and it wouldn't happen. It happened. You I've got... still got people messaging me going, where do you get those fake nails from? They look amazing. I'm like, it's not fucking fake. It's a real nail. Yeah. The amount of people that have messaged me and gone, where do you get those nails from? Fucking We've Wix. had it in the comments as <laughs> well, haven't we? Yes. I can't believe so many people thought it was a real nail. Yeah, it really is a fucking... <laughs> it's a real nail. They're real. Although if they were fake, you'd say they were real. All right, you try it. No, I believe you. I'm just, I'm just playing devil's advocate. You'd have to be you a fucking moron to do that. Um, but no, you got it up there. You did great. That's amazing. Obviously, we're going to be taking that into live performances. I know you're going I've to be sitting down with... I've already asked him next door if he wants to see it, and he flat out refused and ran away. Well, we'll make him. We'll he tie doesn't... him down. 
He doesn't want to watch it. We're going to watch. Why did you tell him what you were going to do? Why didn't you? Do he loves watching magic. Why didn't you just say, "Hey, Tam, want to see a trick?" Because I was practicing in here and then walked outside and I was like that. And he's like, "You've been taking coke in the office." Because <laughs> I was messing around with my nose. <laughs> I went, "No, I've just stuck a nail up it." And he went, "Yeah, yeah, okay." And I was like, "No, no, I genuinely." And he was like, "What? Why have you done that?" And I was like, "It's a magic trick." And he's like, so it's fake now. I'm like, no, no, it's not fake now. He went, so it's not a trick then. And I was like, well, no, I guess not, no. And then I had this whole conversation that I was gonna, I've been sticking four inch nails up my nose. And then I told him I was gonna go outside and show him. And then he said, no. He ran away. <laughs> He really doesn't want to see it. Kind of a visceral reaction. Okay, yeah. so um, there's one. So uh, let me ask you a question before we talk about what's happening this week as we prepare for. Because what's happening this week? I've done it. It's no, done. no, there's a lot more to this, uh, and we're going to be mapping out what happens next in a couple of minutes. But first of all, I've done it though. No, there's more. There's more to this. So first of all, what what does it hurt? Um, the only time it hurts is when it catches a bit that you're not supposed to catch. Like the brain. No, I don't think I've hit my brain. Um, there's nothing there to catch. <laughs> so, there's when you go in, there's like if you if it you have to go in perfectly straight. If you go slightly to the side, you catch like I don't know what area it is, but you catch an area around here somewhere, and then it feels like something stabbing you in the back of the throat. And have you That's, caught that area? Yes. A lot. Yes. So that's not nice. No. It's kind of like, a, I, I imagine the more you shove it in there, the more you'll get used to it. Well, yeah, I guess so. But like, it still hurts. Okay. It's a fucking pointed tipped nail. Yeah. Yeah. I can imagine that. So it's still... I'm very impressed. So... It still hurts. There's three things that's going to happen from this point on. Three? Yeah. So, first of all, we need to do an... Well, four... So first of all, we need to do an informal performance. You fucked up the TAM option, but we need to get you to perform <laughs> it to somebody. Like maybe we'll go to McDonald's and do it to all I've the done guys that. I've in done the, it to Jack. the guy. No, 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 no. Like somebody outside of the office. Like we need to go somewhere and do it. Some maybe somewhere on the industrial estate, or maybe we'll go to the guys at the petrol station. Uh, somewhere we'll what, go. The we'll, new people at the petrol station. Yeah, they like magic. Every time I go in, they go, "Oh, magic TV." Yeah. They watch the YouTube video. They know me as the magician. Yeah, exactly. They go, oh, how's Ryland? But if there's like somebody who's just paying for some juice and then they walk into the petrol station and there's me standing in the middle of the fucking shop. It's fine. So first of all, there's an imp uh, we'll figure out where, but we got, I think McDonald's would be a good option as well. But first of all, we'll... While people are eating, yeah. it would be a terrible option. It would be a great option. We got, what did we get kicked out for? Swallowing a, swallowing a balloon. We got kicked out of McDonald's for trying to swallow a balloon. You know, when we to walk into the <laughs> middle of a fucking restaurant in the middle of the day when there's loads of parents and kids sitting there eating yep. and hammer a nail into my face. Yes. Yes, I do. Yeah, you want that to happen. <laughs> I really fucking do. You want that to happen, but it isn't going to. So I'm not doing that at McDonald's. I'm not. It doesn't have to be McDonald's, but it has to be somewhere. All so fast we need... food restaurant. We could do what we did at Bristol and just find some crackheads. Well, we're in Canic, so that won't be difficult. Exactly, and we can do some... But we need to do, like, an informal uh, thing. Then I want to get you back on with Mark Spellman so he can help you routine this together for a show. And then I want you to put it in a show in front of people. Where? Well, oh, I don't know. If only it was the beginning of November and we've got, like, a fuck ton of shows coming up. You want me to do this for a paying client? Of course. Like, some of the clients we're going to, like corporates, they will fucking love this. I've already thought it through. I thought it could be a transition piece before we put Ryland in the spy crap. Can you imagine? Like, you know, we do Ryland in the spy crap. We stick all the spikes through him. Then we take him out. And then I can go, and then you can go, well, you know, people think that because he's in a box, he's moving out the way. That's not the case. Let me show you what happens. I'll use a nail in my nose. Let's do this. And then some dramatic music. And something like that. Now, um, but the other thing is, we need to discuss what went wrong. What do you mean what went wrong? There was only one nail. What do you mean there was only one nail? Mark does four nails. 
We've got to the point one. We've got... This is the equivalent is of... fucking for real? <laughs> we got... Look, this is the equivalent of preparing for a boxing match and you've got in the ring. That one nail is in the ring. Now, it's ding, ding, round one. Now, we go for nail number two. Now, can you explain to me... You don't want to do nail number two. You didn't want to do nail number one. <laughs> That is a very good point, well made. <laughs> <laughs> and I notice, can you pull that over here? Because I noticed there's like three nails on there. No, I just keep some that you said we were talking about blockheads, so I don't touch them. So, have you tried two nails? No. So explain to me the problem with two nails. There's double the amount that I've done before. Yeah. There's I know. two of them. I know, but in order to get to four... Why would I want to get to four? Because we want to... You know, hey, do you reckon there's a Guinness World Record for the no. amount of nails put up a nose? I don't care if there is. We can break no, it. No, we don't. By we, I mean you. No. You could break no. it. Man. You, right, no. Let, let me just explain my reasoning behind this. You said there's a chance that I might not be able to do it because not everyone's got the right shaped nose. We know you can do it. It's not a question as to whether you can or can't. The nose is the right <laughs> shape. Now, we just need to make a bit more room in there for some more nails. So, today, right now, on this video, we're going to go for two nails. Now, your option, would you rather try one up the left nostril, one up the right nostril, or should we go for them both up the right I'm nostril? I'm not doing the left. Because I know that the left is a bit more painful, but there's a bit more wiggle room in the right. So we start with the right nostril, focus on that. You've worked that in a bit, haven't you? Then we'll work on the left nostril at some point in the future. So, nail number one, get it up there, go. Is, is he just so you know, real? you've just seen an assumptive close. That's what we call an assumptive close in, um, in sales. You're welcome. So, nail number one, up it goes. I've got to do this now. Nah, I'll do it next week. Yes, now. Get a nail. Shove it I don't your... know whether the right. second one goes in the top or the bottom. We're like about to below. find out. Right. You've got an you've got alcohol wipe. Yeah, you've I've got, got loads got, of alcohol yeah, wipes. Yeah, you've got nice clean nails. And you've got your hammering in device. You've got a spoon. You've got everything you need. Now, the first one is easy. Get that nail up that nose. How is it easy? Because you've done it before. Do, I mean, do, do you, you want remember to try... the first show that you did on stage, magic show... And how you were shitting it before the Rooseley Road show. Like, you were absolutely cacking your pants. It's on video. The last episode of Matchumentary Season 1, you were literally shitting yourself. And you know what happened? You went out there, you bossed it. Now, you get a show and you're just like, well, look, you did a trade show last week. And literally, the night before, I was like, what are you going to do? And you're like, I don't know, I'll figure it out. And then you turned up with props that wouldn't work on the stage and you just fucking made it up as you went. You couldn't have done that two years ago at the Rugely Rose. If I'd have said, you're changing it all around, go out there with five little boards and make it up, you'd be like, Pfft. but you've, you've got better at it because you've done it. Well, the more you do something, the better you're going to get at it. That was John Morton. They were even his boards. Cool. The more you've done it. Oh, thank you, John. The more you do something, the better you got it, you do it. So you've got, we know that one nail goes up. It does. So now we're focusing on two. Wouldn't that be I want to be able to turn around to Mark when he has this little uh, uh, Zoom call with you to work out the routine. I want to go, yeah, Mark, he's, he's right up there. Four nails, mate. Four nails. Did you Have you spoke to Mark since I spoke to him? No. So we had this... Did you watch the interview? That's a no. So we... <laughs> If he had have done, there wouldn't have been a single moment's hesitation. I can't, no, I, I was going to watch it and then I realised I couldn't be asked. So the answer was no? No. Yes. So I spoke to Mark about that and said, are there any major benefits to doing more than one nail? Or do you think for a performance-wise stage piece, I could get away with doing one nail? And he said, 100%, you could just do one nail. Cool. So why do I need to do two? Because here's the thing, Matt. Let me talk to you about goal setting, right? So here's the important thing. When you set a goal... Oh, I didn't set this goal! No, but you're going along with it. You've already done one nail. There's bits of the things. You've already done one nail. You're already yeah, along that journey. Pleasant. When you set a goal, right, what you want to do is you want to aim high. Because it's like that old expression. I think sticking a four-inch nail into my face is aiming quite high. Not high enough. Four nails is aiming high. That way, if you fail, you end up with two nails. At the moment, we're on the right path. We've got motivation. That boulder is, is, is turning. It's going. Now, get that nail up that nose. Oh, that's disgusting. I don't, I don't like seeing it. Close up, do you? Ooh. I don't oh, like it's seeing horrible. it at all. Can I do it? No. Please. Can I hammer it? Let me. Let me have a go. <laughs> 
Because you, you always go. Duh, 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 duh. I reckon we could get it up there with one bang. Hey, Michael, go get the hammer. There's hammer. <laughs> Why is that not going in? It's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> that was horrible. That, was like, that actually hurt then, and I don't understand why. I think we need dramatic music at this point. <laughs> I don't think we do. Yeah, we do. Can I do it? Please let me do it. I really want to do it. Matt, why are you not talking to me? Can I hammer it? Give me the, give me the spoon. No. What can I do to let you let me hammer it in? Absolutely nothing. You are not touching this nail. You are not going anywhere near this nail. I really want to hammer it in. <laughs> I so badly want to have a go. Not at my nail, obviously, just to be clear. Right. That's amazing. Isn't that great? Now, that is so good. Honestly, I'm so proud. Right. <laughs> I'll take it. See that? I'll take it. <laughs> so, we've got one up there. Now, to be clear, I <laughs> can't look at you. I'm looking over here. <laughs> now, when you put that nail up that nose, right, it's, it's going up a little hole. The nasal cavity, you called it, right? Yes. So, technically, the second nail is just going through the same cavity. It's yes. not like there's two holes and you pick one. No. In fact, if anything, this second nail is going to be a bit easier. Because the first nail has opened that cavity up. It's almost like somebody holding a door open for somebody else to get through. So, keep your fucking hands over there. <laughs> okay. Grab your spoon, grab your second nail. Let's do this. I don't know where it goes in. I'll figure it out. It's going to go along the same track as the first it nail, It doesn't isn't feel it? like there's room. It really doesn't feel like there's room at all. But I bet there is. What are you doing? Huh? Oh, another alcohol thing. Did you buy these just for shoving nails up your nose? Yeah. <laughs> Hashtag business <laughs> expense. <laughs> Can I have some people. alcohol wipes, please? Why? Well, I need to sanitise a nail. Really? How come? I want to shove it up my nose over and over again. You're telling me you wouldn't put this in a cabaret show, in your, in your cabaret show. This is just going to bring the house down. I wouldn't do it in kids' shows, but in a cabaret show. Oh, really? Why? Ah, it's probably not appropriate. Do you reckon you could get away with it in a family show? Probably not. No. Uh, it'd have to be a full-on corporate. Walk around, wedding, top table. Bride and groom. Get the bride's hammer in. Why would you want why would you want to do this to a bride and groom? It kind of symbolises what's gonna to happen to I don't know. One of them's gonna get a nail in the face. <laughs> I don't know where it goes. It's going to go up the same hole. Shove it up there. It's going to go along the track, right? I need to watch the video again. No, you don't. I really do, because that's not going in. Can you do me a favour and don't lobotomise yourself? It won't go in. You didn't think the first one would go in. You had to train your nose. Yeah, that's not happening. Why not? I don't know, it just won't. I don't know whether the ends of the nail are too big. Oh, that's a clever idea. Slip that one out of it. Does that help? No. I don't think my nostrils are big enough. Oh, shut up. It got one in there. Hey, that's, that's looking like it's making progress. Hammer them both in now. Get your, get your spoon. Are you okay? No. Nope. Your eyes are watering. Are you okay as he's got two nails up his nose? <laughs> this is gripping. That's, that's kind of partially in there. Are you okay? No, it really hurts. Does it? Don't hurt yourself. I mean, only a little bit. Obviously, there's going to be a certain amount of pain for this. Yeah, that's not going in. It will. You just it went need up to, to like there, and then it was like, that genuinely... It, like, that hurt. Okay, try the other nostril. Oh, no, I'm not doing the left. The left doesn't work. How do you know? I tried the left with the pen and I couldn't even do it with the pen. The really? left is fucking, yeah, the left is really painful. I, could, I reckon I could, I'm gonna, tr I'll practice that. But I need to watch the video to see how he does it. Okay. Because I never even contemplated putting two up there. 
Okay, so can we aim for next episode to have two nails up there and then we can I mean, find I can try, but... I reckon you can do it. Can I take this out now? No. <laughs> we keep it in for the rest of the thing. It's just amazing. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to do it, where do you want to uh, do this? We need to find somewhere to go and do it. Do you reckon we can force Tam to watch it? I don't think I can force a fully grown man to do anything, really. <laughs> like... Can I pull it out? No. Oh, please. Wiggle it. Can I wiggle it? Can we, give me the thing. Let me, let me pull it Get out. Get your me, hands give away me, from let, my face. Let me, come Stop. On. <laughs> let me, come on. Stop. Give me the nail. I want to pull it out. Come on, let me. Stop. Oh. No. You know, you are a lot more. F oh, you've got something hanging off your nose. Nice. <laughs> you were a lot more fun before you started hammering nails in your face. Was I really? You were. So, yeah. action plan for next week. Two nails. I think two is enough. What do you reckon? Do you? Do? Yeah. I think you think two is enough? I mean, if you get two, it's only a short hop and skipping a jump to three. But I reckon two is probably... It's made me snot all over myself in front of the fucking internet. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear me. It's impressive. It's very... Did you throw the nails away? Yeah. Why? Because I've got a box of them. You should give them away as a souvenir. Who's going to want a nail that's been up my nose? Put it in a little bag. Even so, why would anybody want a nail that's been up my nose? So people can... Why would somebody want a folded up playing card? A signed playing card. Why would somebody want a bent coin? A, a, a bent fork? If, if I didn't know you and you came over to me and you had a nail up your nose and you said, would you like this as a souvenir and you gave it me in a nice sanitised little bag, I'd be like, fuck yeah, give me that nail. I'm going to show everyone I met an idiot. Why do you throw them away after you've used them? Because they rust. But not straight away. Surely you can get some uses out of it first. Not straight away, no. But I mean, I'm not going to use that again now for a while, so. Why not? Next week. Yeah, but if I left it for a week, it rusted. Oh. Fair enough. So. And they're like, you get a whole box. You get like fucking. Like 35, 40 nails or so, I'll give it a take. But like a fiver. I'm going to speak to Tam and see if he'll let us um, perform the nail trick to it. I've already spoke to him, he won't. Why? Because he doesn't want to watch it. You need to explain it to him properly. How much explaining <laughs> is there to... I get a nail, mate, and then I hammer it into my face with a spoon. And they'll be like, oh, right, okay, that, okay, that's fine then. That's all right then, Let's, yeah, fine, fucking... <laughs> well, we need to find somebody. It's either that or McDonald's. Uh, we, we can't do it at McDonald's. Okay, then that just leaves us with the petrol station. Can you explain to him... In words that he'll understand. The, the police will probably end up being called on us. <laughs> we nearly got barred from McDonald's for fake swallowing a balloon. I remember that. Yet he wants to actually hammer a nail into my face. Do you really mean, do you really mean that? Can I hammer it? No! <sighs> so boring. Oh, yeah! Boring! So boring! Not having this... Giant gibbon having <laughs> a fucking nail into my face. How fucking unfun of me. I know. I'm disappointed. Oh, well, you're going to have to I've say seen that, Mark right? Spellman allow spectators, complete strangers, to hammer it into his face. Yeah. So I'm not a complete stranger. No. I we I, I'm I'm I know how much of an idiot you are. I'm a fully trained professional magician. You know how dexterous well, my hands are. I've got are. loads of nails. If you want to try them yourself, no, no, it's not my style. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. This is all about you, mate. Not about me. If anyone would like to see Craig try this, it's never going please to happen. Pop it in the comments. It's the never bottom. going Share to happen. Share this video around to everyone that you know. And anyone that would like Craig to try this, please pop your comments in. How many comments is it going to take? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? 200. 200? I reckon that's doable. Doable. I'll share it around. 
No, I'm going to pay for bot comments. <laughs> yeah, I will know if it's a fucking bot comment. <laughs> if we can get 200 people saying, Craig, I want you to do it. He's just said it. I'm not, I'm not confirming. He's just said it, right? He has just said it. So 200. if we get 200 people saying, I want Craig to do this. Then I'll get Ryan to do it. Then, then no. you've got to do it. No. You've just said it. <laughs> You've just said it. Look, okay, look, let's put a pin in that because Frank or a nail. No, him. because frankly, this I isn't about me. I can find two hundred people. Here's the thing, right? I have. I'm at the top of my game. I am an internationally famous, successful creator, magician, and sex symbol. I. I the whole point of this stuff Fucking is to help symbol. you. I have to help you. What's the symbol? Get from here. A question to mark. Here. What are you about? <laughs> You said you're an international <laughs> sex symbol. I yeah. said, what's the symbol? A question mark. I've told you many, many times. All the men want to be me. All the women want to be with me. Remember that. <laughs> I'm not even you. sure your wife wants to be with you. After <laughs> there are times when I haven't pissed her off, okay? So, right. you know, it, it's few and far between. There are times that I've pissed off. But anyway, so next week on the match of entry, uh, Matt will be shoving two nails up his nose. No, I'll just, I'll try. He's going to try and shove two nails up his nose and we're going to find somewhere for him to perform it. We are going to get a live performance outside of this, oh my God. I thought it was something you could show to. Katie. <laughs> Katie. Oh, where are we going this weekend? Ah, oh, can you do it at Newmark? Oh, Danny's not on the stage, but Danny's already asked me to perform it to him. Danny wants to see it in the gala show. Not in the gala show. In the gala no, show. No, he has, no, in the gala show. Gala, gala, gala. Oh, there's no I'll camera. Find the, I'll find the perfect music. There's oh, no I'm camera. taking the camera. No, there's no like projection. Doesn't matter. It's New Market. You're two centimetres away from the audience. You just whack that motherfucker up there and just shove your nose in people's faces. That's fine. We, no, I'm not doing it in the gala show. So, but Danny has. If you're coming to the New Market Magic Convention in the gala show, you heard it here first. Matt is going to be shoving him a nail no, into his nose. I've got the perfect music. I'm not doing it. Can't touch this. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. I'm not doing it in the gala show. He's doing it. But in the gala Danny show. has asked me to do it for him to show him. So I am going to take my nails and I'm going to sit there and show Danny. So if I get somebody to film that, that could be a live performance on that. I'm happy with that. And, you know, obviously the gala show, we'll film it in the gala show as well. Because you're doing, doing it in, it in the, gala the gala show. show. Doing it in the gala show. It's going to be amazing. We're going to be brilliant. It's going to, I can, I can picture it right now. Right, I'll comment, you'll comment, Jack will comment. That's three. So I need 197 <laughs> other people to comment on this fucking post. Just whoever you know, it's time to switch whether they like now. this channel or work. not, Guys, whether they okay. like magic, stop whether talking. they like the stop channel, talking. whatever stop it is, stop talking. Stop just talking. share stop the talking. video to get just everyone that you know. Will you stop and fucking just, talking? Just say so you don't even have to watch right. the video. Okay, we're done. Thanks just, for watching. Thank you very much. It. We'll see you again next we week. Cut the fucking video now!